Today is all about gratitude. It's day 57. Uh, it's a little loud here. Okay, so where were we? Day 57. It's all about gratitude, but uh, still a little busy here. Uh, a lot of traffic, but we'll take in the view. Okay, so day 57 for the third time. It's nice and quiet up here. Lionsgate Bridge in the background, North Shore Mountains. Okay, so it's all about gratitude. I'm very thankful for the people in my life. Uh, Jamie Grimes at Synergy Health, uh, Jasper Blake at B78, Chris Kinnear at Popeyes, Bill Fry at the Trek Bike Store, John Watson at Wolf Meal Prep, Kyla Gagnon at Kyla Fit, and Brenly Cunningham at Drip Fit. I, oh, Levi at Element Athletics and Tom Baxter at Aura Restore. I think I got them all. Without their help, I wouldn't have been able to do the last 57 days. So, a lot of people have been asking, what is next? Do I start over? I'm at 57 videos. Do I want to continue on? Start over at zero. What do I want to do? What do you think I should do? First of all, when I first started this challenge, I was wobbly. I had a lot of disbelief in myself. I. I I got on the bike and I was like, wow, it's just like, oh, I'm, I'm all over the place. I fell over a few times, didn't add that into videos. I was clicked in, at a stoplight, fell over, was embarrassed. Oh, there's a plane. Didn't feel well at all and didn't want to put it into a video. There, I said it. So, fast forward, I got trained by some amazing people. I didn't know anything about nutrition. Uh, that was a big part. I didn't realize like how big Nutrition is part of this. Uh, you get to 60K, you're sore, you're aching. You know, it's, it, I didn't realize how important Lycra is. It's not just about the look. Aerodynamics is, takes a big part into it. Nutrition. Uh, Synergy Health told me about acupuncture, which I never thought would help in a million years. Needles and things kind of freaked me out, but like, it's amazing. Uh, orthotics have helped my back. I'm, I don't have a sore back anymore. Physiotherapy has shown me all sorts of different exercises and st uh, stretching. And uh, Tom is an RMP, RMT helping me with different things. And I'm getting stronger every day. Uh, I've just, I felt, I've been feeling amazing. I've been learning about the bike. Uh, I did the challenge, 225 kilometers. I did it. 225 kilometers 114 the first day which was 117 and 108 the next day 225 if i got the math correctly i did it so what's next let's train for and i hope i pronounce this correctly le top uh, in french le top maybe uh, australia there is a race november 29th and 30th in the snowy mountains of Australia. I'm gonna train for that. I'm gonna add a whole bunch more videos, a whole bunch more content. I'm going to try to hit 100 days in a row with videos. So this is 57, so 43 after this. And the challenges aren't just going to be about me. I'm gonna be in the videos, but they're gonna be more so targeted towards endurance athletes and athletes in general people that aren't just beginners more intermediate type stuff spoken by true athletes as i help them share their stories and a whole bunch of fun fitness facts so i can't wait to get started uh, i hit my goals for the ride to conquer cancer i did it and I feel great. Uh, the BC Cancer Foundation added me to their team. Uh, it's in the videos. I feel amazing and I can't wait to hopefully be part of it next year in one way or another. I'd like to build more of a cycling community in Victoria on the island 
and I'm gonna talk to the BC Cancer Foundation, so if you're listening to this, I would love to help you guys out and build a stronger community on the island because it's difficult to come over. Plain and simple, I was talked to so many different people and they said the money spent coming over could be raised. Hint, hint. So, let me help you help others. That being said, thank you very much, 57 days in a row. Thank you to everyone that's helped me out. My arm is starting to hurt now, and this is Vancouver. It's just so beautiful. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. Sharing is caring.